Hello everyone, you are welcome to how to evaluate this very nice expression 2 to the power 49 plus 2 to the power 9 plus 2 to the power negative 1 divided by 2 to the power 29 minus 2 to the power 19 plus 2 to the power negative 1. So, let us start by multiplying this expression by 2 over 2. So, this will become 2 times 2 to the power 49 will become 2 to the power 49 times 2 plus 2 to the power 9 times 2 plus 2 to the power negative 1 times 2 divided by 2 times this expression will become 2 to the power 29 times 2 minus 2 to the power 19 times 2 plus 2 to the power negative 1 times 2. Now, this 2 has power 1, this 2 has power 1, this 2 has power 1 and this 2 has power 1. So, by using uh, this uh, power rule a to the power m times uh, a to the power n is equal to a to the power m plus n. This will become 2 to the power 49 plus 1 50 plus 2 to the power 9 plus 1 10 plus 2 to the power negative 1 plus 1 0 divided by this will become 2 to the power 29 plus 1 30 minus 2 to the power 19 plus 1 20 plus 2 to the power negative 1 plus 1 will become 0. Next, this uh, 2 to the power 50 can be written as uh, 2 to the power 10 times 5 plus 2 to the power 10 plus uh, this uh, 2 to the power 0 will become 1 divided by this uh, 2 to the power 30 can be written as uh, 2 to the power 10 times 3 minus this uh, 2 to the power 20 can be written as uh, 2 to the power 10 times 2 plus this 2 to the power 0 will become 1. Now, by using this power rule a to the power m times n is equal to a to the power m whole to the power n. This expression will become 2 to the power 10 whole to the power 5 plus 2 to the power 10 plus 1 divided by this uh, 2 to the power 10 times 3 will become 2 to the power 10 and whole to the power 3 minus this uh, 2 to the power 10 times 2 will become 2 to the power 10 and uh, whole to the power 2 plus this 1. Now, we suppose that uh, let 2 to the power 10 is equal to x. So, this expression will become x to the power 5 plus x plus 1 divided by x cubed minus x squared plus 1. Now, in the numerator we add and subtract x squared. So, this will become x to the power 5 minus x squared plus x squared plus this x plus 1, x plus 1 divided by this denominator remains same, x cubed minus x squared plus 1. Next, from these two terms x to the power 5 minus x squared, we can factor out x squared and in back left x cubed minus 1 plus this expression x squared plus x plus 1 divided by this denominator 
x cubed minus x squared plus 1. Next, now this one is same as 1 cubed. So, by using this algebraic identity a cubed minus b cubed is equal to a minus b times a squared plus a b plus b squared. This expression in the numerator will become x squared times x minus 1 times x squared plus x plus 1. From these three terms x squared plus x plus 1, we can factor out plus 1. In back left x squared plus x plus 1 divided by this denominator x cubed minus x squared plus 1. Now, in the numerator this x squared plus x plus 1 is common. So, we factor out this x squared plus x plus 1 and in bracket left bracket left this x squared times x minus 1 plus 1 in bracket left x squared times x minus 1 plus 1 divided by this denominator x cubed minus x squared plus 1 next x squared plus x plus 1 times this x squared times x will become x cubed and x squared times negative 1 negative x squared plus this one divided by this denominator x cubed minus x squared plus 1. Now, this x cubed minus x squared plus 1 will be cancelled out with this x cubed minus x squared plus 1. So, we are left with only this expression x squared plus x plus 1. Now, recall that we have supposed we have supposed that uh, 2 to the power 10 is equal to x. We have supposed that uh, x is equal to 2 to the power 10. So, this expression will become 2 to the power 10 squared plus uh, 2 to the power 10 plus 1. Now, this uh, 2 to the power 10 is equal to 1024. So, this expression will become 1024 squared plus 1024 plus 1. Next, this 1024 can be written as 1000 plus 24 whole squared plus 1024 plus 1. Now, by using this algebraic identity a plus b whole squared is equal to a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. This 1000 plus 24 whole squared will become 1000 squared plus 2 times 1000 times 24 plus 24 squared plus this expression 1024 plus 1, 1024 plus 1. Next, this 1000 squared will become 1, we write 6 zeros, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 plus this 2 times 24 will 48 and 48 times 1000 will become 48000 plus this 24 squared will become 576 plus 1024 plus 1. This 576 plus 
1024 will become 1600 and 1600 plus 1 will become 1601. So we add these three numbers 1 million plus 48,000 plus 1601. Add these three numbers to get the final answer. So, 0 plus 1 is 1, 0, 6, 8 plus 1, 9, 4, 0 and 1. This is the final answer of this problem.